channel. I'm just getting ready to make some meatballs. I'm going to have meatballs with these raviolis. I just got back from the grocery store and they had these in the freezer section. They didn't have the full size. These have the spinach. So I've got the water. Got the water on the stove, bringing it to a boil. But you know, before I went down, something told me, you know, go check in the cellar. See if you have any of those masks. I don't know, I, I just thought it was over you know, overblown with the mask because there's some controversy about whether these work or not. But I found these in the cellar, uh, unopened pack of these dust masks. So I decided to go take some along, you know. So when I get down to the local grocery store, I couldn't believe it. I think I mentioned in the last video, I haven't been to the grocery store maybe in two weeks and uh, at least over a week. And I couldn't believe there was a queue to go into the grocery store so to, like they did with the Home Depot. The last time I went to Home Depot, they have a limit on the number of kids, uh, the number of kids, the number of people that can go into the store. And uh, I looked and I'm like, oh, people are wearing masks because I just left this in the car. So I was trying to see if I could see anybody without a mask, and I don't think I saw anybody without a mask. So I went back to the car, because I didn't take it. I got my mask. By the time I came back, I noticed some people without masks, and the queue was gone. So there was only maybe, there was less than 10 people waiting outside, but I thought it was more serious than it was. But I already have the hamburger with Italian breadcrumbs, diced onions, and uh, salt and pepper without the pepper. I forgot, I didn't have any peppercorns left. So these aren't gonna have any pepper in it. But I put my mask on before I went in. And, and what happens is that it directs the breath underneath my glasses. So as soon as I went in, I couldn't see. I was all, my glasses were all fogged up. I'm like, this isn't going to help. So I, I positioned it. I had a position it so it was like a little lower. It still does it though. So yeah, it's, I don't know where people are getting their masks from. A lot of them had that. It's a flat type of mask, the white ones. So let me stop yapping and start squishing. It's going to be like a, a hamburger slime video. Did I miss that train? A slime video is still popular.
everyone. Homemade meatballs and spinach ravioli. Homemade meatballs, but the spinach ravioli is just frozen. And I have a nice salad with some garlic toast or Texas toast. And I have some Caesar salad, um, Caesar dressing. Gotta finish this off. And a Fanta. This is this is gonna be so good. Guess the spinach ravioli. You see it in. Shit. 
always eat my salad with my meal. I know a lot of times they deliver the salad before you get your meal, and people eat their salad, and then they finish the meal later, but I, I've always eaten the salad along with my meal.
these meatballs turned out perfect. And I'm not even noticing. There's no pepper. I don't know what I was thinking when I only put two on my plate. I see another meatball sub in my future.
grocery store. There were sh there were shingles, roofing shingles all over the street. Somebody lost their roof. We had a big windstorm yesterday. I thought I was going to lose the greenhouse, but it survived. Our story where all these uh, these pet adoption agencies and all these kennels they're all sold out everybody has all this free time on their hands I guess or to relieve stress in my head they all went and adopted a pet I, I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing because if they didn't have a time for a pet before this what happens when things start, start to go back you know, when they start reopening in the country, people are going to start bringing their pets back. again if you want to stop and buy and uh, help and support the channel thank you for your continued support really appreciate it thank you for your comments and uh, thank you uh, to all my PayPal contributors and thanks again for using the Amazon links in the description to get you over to Amazon to make any of your Amazon purchases I really appreciate that so thanks again for stopping by, and uh, until next video, everyone, bye.